Oops, I think I this deleted my guy. computer. Ah, uh, how did how do we know? Jack Dolan lost his video. No, I think he I deleted, deleted my computer, accidentally. Yeah, yeah, I think he uh, system thirty two. Oh, nice. Why is this guy so stupid? Why are there still? Why are we still here? No, Marius raced an army. Why are we still playing oh, Pikmin? <laughs> it's Pikmin plus one. I'm tired of Pikmin. Oh, that's a really bad thing to say. Now I'm upset. <laughs> oh, there it is. You can always, you know, sing the Whoop, James there Bond song. It is. If that would help, I don't know how it would help, but uh. What? You could always sing the James Man song. James Man song? For, for the Pikmin. I don't know that what that would anything. help for, but. I don't think anyone uh, would mind. Moral issues. Oh, yeah, there's that. So we go through all this trouble to find this sweet star, and then Lord Crump just kind of comes and takes it from us. He's a dick. Oh. Yeah, shit. And then we don't bother stopping him, we're like, oh, okay, you could just say, like, you're half of the story, and oh, wait, you're gonna try to blow us up. Shit. What a fancy name. Lord Crump? No. Uh, time bomb. What was it? Just time bomb detonator? What it was. <laughs> yes, that, like, is, that is descriptive. Beat around the bush. <laughs> you oh, have you gave us fucking like three minutes to get, or seven minutes to get, five minutes. Five minutes. Mm. Okay, I couldn't think of how many <laughs> times. Hundred seconds. Sixty set. Um, oh shit! This is Man, I was yeah, so never good at divin. So. To get out of the tree, uh, it's kind of a long time. I don't see how someone could actually fuck that up, but you know. Well, it, it's a game for babies, isn't it? Sort of? Yeah. Yeah, it's a baby game, but... I, I think even then, like, five minutes is kind of ridiculous. There is no threat of any sort of danger or anything. Oh, that is actually the door. <laughs> well then. Yes, and you have to unlock it. No. It's those are the types oh, okay. of things they probably okay. throw yeah. into. Not quite out yet. They're just no, there's still uh, I don't know, four or five rooms. But no, each room takes like a couple seconds. They're pretty close to the heat, uh, entrance already. Why do you have a counter for those guys? Um, just so you know if they're all following you or not, because there's some buttons that require all of them. Like getting that sorrow piece at the end, you had to have all all of them standing on there, um, and it'd be hard to just look and be like, "Yep, that's 101 duties." So uh, I thought it was gonna yeah. turn into a game of lemmings. You can't just count. Well, this is lemmings right here. It's like, oh, I gotta get back across the uh, this little bridge. Off you go. Oh, there we go. They had parasol. It's there's bubble juice. Down there. <laughs> you pushed yeah. them right back down. <laughs> well, they, they they weren't following my orders, and uh, there's still a couple. <laughs> That's annoying. It's just paper physics. So if you're not on the exact same plane as they are, you're not gonna blow them. Let's not talk about that. But I, I thought you were yeah, like going to have orders. to sacrifice <laughs> some of them. To get out or something. <laughs> I don't even know if you need them to like get back here. This level I'm sure sucks. You could yeah, I'm sure you could just run back to the entrance. I don't even think you need all the punies. But I'd feel bad leaving one behind. So uh, let's uh, chill for a bit. Were they like giving you a massage? Yeah. At this point, it's like okay, let's just uh, let's check out this level. We got some water flowing in the background. What's up with that? How much you want to bet the fat guy is gonna be all sarcastic after the tree blows up? He was uh, sarcastic before the tree even blew up. Yeah, but I mean, like, oh great, our tree blow up. Great job. Well done. Good job, Mario. God. 
Oh yeah, so the timer also goes down when there's dialogue, so... That's something. Oh, I don't need I don't five minutes and it's down to 50 seconds. <laughs> I don't know if that's some Japanese thing, like Lord Crump was getting smaller while he was getting yelled at. Yeah, it's to show that, you know, like, your ego has He's shaking shrunk boots. because you can yell that. What would it's I almost on the same level as, like, everyone falling down. Yeah. When something embarrassing happens. What would an elder power be, exactly? I don't know, but why Eagles. does the timer go with the dial? Actually, that's kind of cool if you really think about it, because that's what would really happen. So... Yeah. Gotta kind of... Makes sense. Yeah. Oh, shit, we only got, like, 14 seconds. He's gonna have to pause that, so... Does it manually bring it down that low when you start this cutscene? Oh, there oh <laughs> so if it doesn't finish... Mm, probably shut off that timer... Okay. So that wait... Is, uh, pretty close. So he'll stop it at whatever it is, it just was it coincidence that that was literally half a second yeah. away from... <laughs> I try to stop it, like, as close as possible. That's nuts. Boss battle time. It's like, well, I couldn't blow you up, so uh, I'm gonna go into my giant robot. Oh. It looks like a cardboard box. <laughs> that's that's better. For for a second there, I was kind of like, oh, that thing doesn't like have it... any jumpable angles on it. <laughs> well, I like how it. it has the, like, accordion, like, folded paper for, like, arms and legs. <laughs> it looks flimsy as shit. Just, uh, bring out the, the wind woman there and just blow it away. No, she's, uh... Just bring out some fire. She's not useful. Destroy the whole world. No, that's too dangerous. Fire in this world is oh, yeah. very uh <laughs> match. It's like already. peace in hours. <gasps> Deep, bro. So for this battle I was gonna try something a little bit different. Uh instead of just kinda of whittling him down, I was gonna use a different badge that Mario has before that. Let's uh see what he's all about. He's got one defense, that's uh it's not a lot. It means it takes at least two damage per attack. Super gnarly. <laughs> <laughs> and his fists even have stats. I think Mario. But we're not going to worry about that. If Mario was smarter, he might go like just a little bit. He might go something like, "Stop complimenting like, <laughs> the bad guy." She's like, "I can't tell if it looks <laughs> cool or really, really stupid." <laughs> like, man, I'm switching sides. Like, not sides even just like I don't. Cool I can't tell if it looks cool or stupid, but it's just like. Blatantly, <laughs> just, or really fucking stupid. That that it's, thing looks uh, dumb as fuck. I'd say it's pretty cool. It looked like he was patting your head with his foot. Yeah, he wants to like massage us a little bit, tenderize us, and then he goes in for the kill. So while Gumbella smacks her head on him, we're gonna use the charge badge to uh, get some really good damage going here. And you can stack it every turn, so. I like it more and more the more he charges. I like the animation for it. It looks like he's like um, dragging his feet to build static electricity. <laughs> That's how he powers himself. There you go. Power up. Yeah, I'm really terrible at timing it. He like uh, goes back and forth like four or five times and never stops. So far, it hasn't been very impressive in the offensive yeah. department. No, this boss isn't really, uh, that amazing or anything. And he walks up and, and starts, like, wiggling back and forth. It looks like, should I stomp this guy, this guy? I don't know. And then he just has to put his foot down at some point. He's, he's dead. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I remember this tactic. Yeah. It works even better in this game, because you can get multiple charge badges, so... Oh, man. Like right there, I did like, I don't know, like 30 damage. His whole life for him, so. I was kind of getting tired of that fight, anyways. Lord Crumb's cool, but. Come on. You got a shitty robot. Was it a robot, even? It just looked well, like an arts and crafts project. By definition, in this paper world, that was about as robotic as you're gonna get. No, 
That explains why all their technology sucks. <laughs> Who needs technology? We're trying to make these paper cogs, but they well, like, we have to switch them out every 30 minutes or so. These keep falling apart. Okay, so we've got the star back. Woo! And the tree didn't get exploded. Yeah. Oh, that doesn't really bother me too much. No. But, uh, we were in it at the time, so. Oh, yeah, that might have annoyed. Kind of it was just an inconvenience for us, so we had to deal with it. What does happen if it blows up? Does it just go Using wide and say game over? Or? <laughs> Probably. You, you I don't even know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think anyone knows. I think it's a mystery that's uh, best left unsolved. And then... It becomes an entirely different story. Like, <laughs> yeah, entirely dark the game and... completely changes. Like, uh, the Mushroom Kingdom uh, issues a non-tolerance policy on terrorism. <laughs> <laughs> you enter Rogueport and, like, the TSA or whatever comes up to you and strip searches you. Man. It's like, hey, what's this hammer in your pocket, sir? You're not allowed to take, take this shoes. on your... He can turn himself into a plane? Oh my god. He's just gonna... F oh, I'm not even gonna go there. <laughs> what? Uh, oh. So we're back here. I'm starting to see a theme going on here. Chapter ends back here. He's got a pretty fancy hat, but... I think that's, uh... Not a hat, it's more of his, uh, central processing station. Oh, I see. His brain. He's also got one inside of his scepter. Well, it just seemed like... He has... A sort of computer on his hat that plays Battleship. Or something. <laughs> with itself. Tic tac <laughs> Calculating... B4. And that's the plot for War Games. Boom. Try again. B. The only way five. to win the game is not to play No, I hit my submarine. <laughs> you just go through. You just. It's like calculating A1, A2, A3, A4. It just goes down each row. And that is the boss Boom. fight against that guy. It's just yeah. a game of battleship. Battleship. Like, yeah, a game of battleship. But it's Babby version, so you can actually see where his ships are. <laughs> no, it's just a game of Battleship, and it's really boring. <laughs> so it's just awful. And he's also yeah, just, just really awful. bad, so you're just like sitting there like... You're not even hitting anything, you're not even making this a challenge. Yeah, and the worst part is that he like, needs forever to think of his turn. So he just sort of sits there <laughs> and... Wait! So more time, more time! You're like, my god, this section's taking hours. It's innovative, uh, innovative, but um, you know, not all idea, uh, all, not all innovative ideas are good ones. No, but you know, they were still trying out new things during this era. You never know. Also, um, is it time for Lovebot again? Yeah, I was gonna yeah. say, where's Pervbot? Here he is. I've been waiting for you. I saw your shower. I was analyzing it for hours. Hell 9000, this is not. No. His priorities aren't straight. I what does this I guy do? I love, like, the, like, helplessness in Peach's eyes. Like, oh, God. He's kind of just like their computer that everyone uses. Grotus comes in here and he's surfing the internet and someone else is like, Hey, I need to use that. No! So they only have one computer in the sit. <laughs> well, what do they do CPU when they want to have LAN parties? No LAN parties. No! At, uh, How do they keep their morale up? We'll never know. Well, they're robots. How are they going to play Call of Duty? <laughs> it's a pretty big screen. But, uh, seems like the pixels The are resolution isn't that broken. Yeah, it's probably like... 
30 ten, by 30. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say 10 by 20. <laughs> but that would be twice as long as it is tall. So he wants to dance with us. Just dance. Right. Just dance. Why is there a I... shadow, <laughs> Peach? It's a hologram. When is it time to panic? Like, I know when he she's... turns it into a studly man and he starts making out with Peach. <laughs> Would you like a different hologram? Here's one of me if I were human. <laughs> like some really big buff dude that like got a huge package and he's wearing Peach like a like, yeah, whatever. speedo. I've drawn an image of what I think it would look like if you were a computer. <laughs> we're playing Babby DDR and I messed it up. Well, I messed up one. This is what I think you'd look like if you were a computer, Commodore 64. <laughs> <laughs> Charming, but low on the processing power. <laughs> well, she is a woman after all. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I did that. I did that. Well done. The Commodore 64 was fantastic. <laughs> the administrative abilities were bar none the best. <laughs> How dare you insult that piece of hardware. <laughs> <laughs> Without that, you would not have your fancy lapper tops. Lapper tops. Yep. It's like a leper top. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like Here's a bad my brand. keyboard. <laughs> leper top. Da -da 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 -da. Leper top. That's the kind of music they make, just like that. But rock. <laughs> well, I mean, there'd be like rock music going on. That was just the singing. He even went. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, it's so a part of the. It'd still be the set verse. to popcorn. <laughs> oh god, I'm trying to remember how it goes. I don't even know what you're talking about. Come on, man, popcorn. Popcorn? Like the, the number you best call and to find only out the time? perfect computer, he says. Well, only is right. I'm the only one. I am the loneliest computer. I'm glad that was done. On his network? Binary is the loneliest language. <laughs> that, I think you that's have way more syllables than the winner. song actually has, so... Yes! <laughs> Bowser. There we go. This is better. We're getting to the real game Bowser. now. Yeah. Fucking Bowser. Paper Bowser. I don't know how, but... Bowser manages to... Seem Suck massive, a lot, even yeah. even in paper form. He manages to what? He manages to appear massive, even in paper form. Well, he's that's why he's the king. They should make it so that he's like the only one who, when he turns around, has like another dimension, sort of, <laughs> just to explain okay, why so he's so heavy. You could blame this for uh, why Super Paper Mario was made. Kind of like a uh, little platform mix section. And if you get the meat, you're fucking huge. <laughs> Man, what a hard game. Those are so great. <laughs> Old right, just like Mega Man. <laughs> yeah, Walter, so how goes walk? practicing? Alright, you said you weren't gonna. Never mind. Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna keep Good that luck. shit. Like, speed. Yeah. <laughs> well, I put you in the newbie group, so you should be fine. It'll be like 30 minutes of me on the same level. <laughs> 30 minutes? That sounds low. <laughs> yeah. You those. have not seen some of the other race videos. <laughs> okay, I shouldn't like talk Buster. about that right now. Sorry. Sorry, face guy. What are you trying to do? You trying to plug other it's people's okay. LP LPs in? Hmm? Blister was stuck on a Robo Master for an hour. So there we go. He was stuck. Well, what's uh, Princess Peach doing here? <laughs> she, uh, she looks kind of strange though. <laughs> yeah, I like his attitude though. 
Mm. Image found. <laughs> I think Bowser is the only other computer. <laughs> like him, he can identify things, but it's not like he, he can't that's go as far as his understanding goes. I like <laughs> how he's like Bowzo, and he's right outside a regular house with I don't know who's in there. Peach? Is that really yeah. Peach? Yeah, it's Peach. Why doesn't he just open the door and take her? He's a fucking he's big ass turtle. Her. Now that's rude. So with this vibrating Koopa, life-size peach poster. What is this? <laughs> why did he have it on his window? <laughs> I like it. Look his, his yeah, face. Yeah, why was it on his window? Maybe he doesn't like to get uh, sunlight in his room. I think he wants to make sure people, or he wants to make it look like someone's home. So when like, so people come up, they're like, "Oh shit, I can't rob that house. There's someone I'm just there." Imagining some guy having like anime wall scrolls all over like the outside of his house. He's taking that pillow shit to another level. Like now he <laughs> now he tries to make it seem like he has an anime living in his house. Yeah, <laughs> like painting over the windows. Well, he fooled Bo Bowser. So. <laughs> That's true. It works. Works. Now, the yeah, army of Mario will march on to new conquests. It, it could, I'm done dealing with them. It Aww. could be like this video. Like, that would probably be the guy to do the anime <laughs> wall poster things. <laughs> That's what my house looks like. <laughs> You're reviewing like hentai and there's people in the background? Like No, there's just anime posters all over my house. Oh. <laughs> Actually, my house is built out of anime posters. No. <laughs> it's like paper mache anime posters. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can't tell anymore, but it's like just just the feeling of being surrounded by anime. The greatest it's, feeling. It's in the warming. World. <laughs> 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 it's heartwarming, or so they say. Video 